What's going on, guys? Welcome back to the Poor Investor. Today, we're going to be going over why the hell Chi is still coming out with 2.0 and this whole GPU plotting stuff. I don't know what's the point of it. No, I'm just kidding, guys. I'm just kidding. I'm going to be going over some of the release notes. Um, and is it like, did it pass this time? I mean, Mad Max had all this flame, flame of uh, fame and glory in regards to GPU plotting, right? And we waited for a really long time for Chia to release theirs. And you know what? It just seems like for me, the hype is over. Like, you know, I, I don't even want to deal with it anymore. I, it, maybe it's just me. And uh, maybe you guys were actually anticipating this to be a very big deal. And you would jump on that bandwagon about six months ago. Was this talked about? I, I, don't, I, I lost track. I totally lost track. But I'm going to go over some of the details on who's actually on 2.0 uh, and for the handful of guys that are, what kind of issues they're running into. All right. So first off, as always, we're going to be talking about the price, $30.14. Now, even though the price has been staying pretty steady at $30, there is something that I want to point out really interesting that Chia XCH is moving up on the ranks. That's only because all, every all the other crypto is probably like just phasing out on its own and by default she is um gaining that momentum in ranking a lot of bullish people here um i'm it, I, i'm seeing that there's more and more newcomers into this space and of course as newcomers coming into the space they are reluctant to look back at history and how certain things are done and they're just asking these repetitive questions that i've seen over and over again and you know it's kind of um what do you call that it's like every every generation gets dumber and dumber i'm just saying <laughs> maybe that wasn't a great example but anyway uh here i'm bullish on xch uh wow guys i'm excited Cyrus deal volume is increased. What what the hell is this? This doesn't have nothing to do with uh, XCH. Anyway, thirty dollars. Uh, right here is the twenty seven point six EIBs current network space on Chia Network. And let's see what's interesting over here. Nothing so interesting here. I don't think so. Nothing here. But this this is more interesting. Node counts internationally all over the place was more a lot more than this at, at, at a given time so we're downsizing to 105,000 now I'm curious to know if this will ever fall below the 100,000 mark because once this number hits back like to 99 or in the 90s it just shows like how much people are dropping off right so now here's the other thing 2.0 was released only today and a lot of people were on 1.82 now, there is some volume here that people are getting onto 2.0, but are you guys jumping on 2.0 because you were having issues or do you really want to start replotting, right? I, I don't, I'm not sure which route you're going, but I, for one, am not replotting. I pretty much, I think I'm done with that part. I'm, done, I'm totally done with that part. Here is the whole crypto space currently. Uh, a lot of new stuff that I have no idea what the hell it is. And you guys probably claim that I don't even know what the hell Chia is. All right. And keep telling me, refer back to the white paper. But anyway, we are looking for XCH right now. Where the hell? I just saw it before. Where did it go? At first glance, I do not see anything. You see it? Nope. See, I'm not blocking it either. So where is it? My goodness. I, I swear I just had it open before. And I was like, oh, it moved up in ranks. And that's how I got to even talk about that. Oh, you know what? I'm going to come back to this because this is pretty frustrating now that I can't even find it. I just literally had it right. And it was so, so like tiny. I don't know where it went. Do not know where it went. Top 200. It's definitely within the top 200. Because I saw the ranking. Even though I'm not pulling it up right now, it was rank 125. It has moved up a great deal. All right. So... Let's go to the official Chia page right now. I know actually this is a Chia form. Let's go to the official Chia page right now. And I clicked on Chia Blockchain 2.0 release notes. Here is the release notes. And we're just going to go over a couple of the um, line items here. Wow, it's a lot. Holy cow. 
I didn't actually, I didn't anticipate so much of it, but let's, let's get to the juicy part, right? Let's get to the juicy part. 2.0, um, do, 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 for farmers, it's official here. Plot compression GPU plotting is now, now available to determine how you might strategize to get the most out of your farm. Please check out this uh, blog post. Here's what's included in this release plotting. Okay. Bladebit 3.0 release, create compressed uh, K32 plot using RAM plot or the new GPU plotting command. CUDA plot to increase your effective space and earn more farming rewards. <sighs> I mean, that's great and all. Wow. Wait, hold up. Hold up. Uh, I said that's great and all, but 256 gigs minimum RAM support when using a GPU or 416 gigabyte minimum RAM support when using a CPU. I have neither. NVIDIA GPU with 8 gigs of VRAM, uh, pretty common. Uh, most 30s, actually all 30s have 8. I, I don't know which one would have 4. Maybe the older models. But anyway, support of Windows and Linux. All right. Uh, plot from the uh, GUI or from CLI. Existing uncompressed plots will still continue to work. Okay. That's where I am now. Uncompressed plots. The original OG plots. Well, maybe not the original OG one. The original OGs, you couldn't even uh, join pools with. So I would say second generation, right? The, the NFT plots. Those are pretty hardcore requirements. If you're going to jump into this whole GP. I mean, ooh, the amount of money that you have to spend on buying this kind of hardware is, I mean, unless you get it for free or you get it at work or someone you guys are like, you know, fortunate enough like that. But if you actually have to spend money to even buy this in the used market, shoot, how, how much longer would you have to farm in order to recuperate that expense, right? That, that's insane. I'm definitely not, ah, my God, I can't go that route. That's, that's killing myself. Um, farming, harvesting, GPU harvesting or compressed plots. Uh, I mean, pretty much this whole thing is focused on this whole GPU stuff, but we're going to get some more, uh, in, more interesting things. Uh, some of the user um, comments and, and forum posts that, you know, they're, they're encountering whatever issues. So let's just see what the known issues were. Bladebit will crash when the target destination drive is full. Well, no kidding. This will be fixed in Bladebit 3.1 beta, but a workaround is just restart Bladebit. Okay. Sending cats from Gobi to 2.0 wallet won't show up. And well, I didn't know. Uh, can't sync full note. From zero to testnet 10, GPU harvesting, certain uh, NVIDIA GPUs and driver combination on certain platforms will encounter a known error. Okay. View uh, offer file resulting in seeing no assets being offered. Your wallet is synced, but the balance is incorrect. And you also create a high volume of offers less than or greater than 50. Uh, yeah, let's see what else. Uh, corrupt plots on Windows 10 on certain combination of NVIDIA cards and drivers. Please use Windows 11 to plot. Uh, GPU, uh, GUI crashes, GUI crashes when clicking on contacts. Work around, log out of the wallet and log back in. Okay. So, over high overview of the added items into this version of 2.0. That's pretty big, right? I mean, we've I'm a long way. It's been, has it been three years now? Two years, three years? Compress plot support, add configure options to accept private network address from introducers. Introducers, yeah. Generate a license directory that contains license missing from the installers. 2.0 updates, add data layer clear pending root interface, add get wallet address, RPC for deriving wallet addresses. Hmm. Multi-threaded Chia plot check, hard fork 2.0, add fields to block record. I don't know what this crap is. Uh, I, I lost. I'm lost. Uh, all right. A lot of changes. Huge. Huge. Ooh, look at all this gooey changes. Look at all this fancy. Oh, my God. There's so much crap here. There's no way I would have read all this out to you guys. But I said I was going to go back to the forums. Uh, Chia GUI 2.0, be careful, isn't reading compressed gigahorse plots, at least not my C8 ones. Uh, I'm not going to go through every ones here, but right here, Matt Max answered himself. He commented here 10 hours ago, 
The 2.0 GUI is not compatible with 1.8 gigahertz. There's been big changes to the RPC interface. I think that's his last comment here. I don't see anything else. Who's this Chia Pizza? No idea who these people are anymore. I haven't, I haven't been on these forums. I haven't been uh, snooping around as much. Even on the Reddit, Chia Reddit official, I have not gone there for some time now. All right. So that's pretty much it. My, you know, the version 2.0 was out. You guys can do compressed plots, official compressed plots, without having to use Mad Max's compressed plots, which is the Giga Horse. Uh, I never got into that. I, I said in my past videos, like, oh, I, let me test it out. Maybe I'll do it. But then the, the system requirements were just uh, too much for me to even handle. Like the most I have on my any given machine is 128 gigs of RAM. I know I can do something with it, but I just opted not to. Because honestly, I think I'm just going to keep the way everything I have with Chia, the plots, the 200 plus uh, terabytes that I have that's plotting. I actually have 2,900 blah, blah, blah plots right now, still farming and, and one harvester behind me. And uh, I'm still earning. I'm still part of a pool. It's still accumulating, but I don't feel the need to actually redo everything and compress everything and try to fit more in. Uh, I think I'll end up spending too much time on that, which is not something I'm looking to do. So uh, that's pretty much it, guys. I, I, you know, I'm here just to, you know, relate whatever messages I see as far as the latest and greatest news of Chia. But honestly, I think that hype kind of died down and I, I really don't find much interest in it. And you guys can say whatever it is that you want about me in regards to that. But um, that's just how I feel. I mean, I, I think the momentum has slowed down tremendously. Everyone was so hyped up and anticipating, looking, oh, my God, I could use GPUs with this and that. And honestly, my GPUs over here, this uh, 6600 XTs, eight of them, I already sold five. I just need the money, guys. I just need the money. All right. So I want to thank you guys for being here. Please remember to hit that like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys again really soon. Bye.